Ah, <laughs> good. Good, I said good. God's good. Just like this coffee's good. Hey, God's good. Think I have another little sip of this here. Told you yesterday, love Honda and coffee. Was running out. Hey, I'm so blessed that a friend of mine, Lewis, missionary in Honduras, he brought me the coffee. I'm talking about he got it in Honduras. Actually, the coffee that I get is made up in the mountains. It's not what you buy over the counter down there. But he went up to get it. Um, they brought it to me. They came up this way to go to Tennessee to be with some people. He stopped by my house, handed me two big bags of coffee. I'm a blessed man. The blessings of God are overtaking me. Now, I'm talking to you the rest of this week, last week of the year, about God's good. And Psalm 138, 8, I believe it says that God perfects those things that concern me. My children concern me. My body concerns me. You know, you can't live on this earth without an earth suit. You see, the astronauts had to have a space suit. Well, they took it off when they got back here because they didn't need it anymore. Well, when I leave, I'll take my earth suit and put it off. I don't have to have it anymore. But as long as I'm here, I want it to work good. I want it to feel good. I want to be able to run, jump, leap, and holler, and shout, and have a good time. Jesus bore my sicknesses so that I could enjoy life. Excuse me, my, my nose itching there just a little bit. But I want to get this across to you, James chapter 1. Every good and every perfect gift cometh down from above from the Father of lights, and watch this, with whom is no variableness. I've said this to you a lot. <clears throat> I am blessed. But God's not going to do for me what he won't do for you. See, he's not going to keep me in divine health and make you sick to teach you something. That's just not in the Bible. I mean, dear God, just, you know, like I told you, Charles Cap said, the Bible's easy to understand. Do what the Bible says and resist the evil and receive the good. <clears throat> now watch this. Jesus said this, John 10, 10. The thief cometh, but for to steal, kill, and destroy. But I am come that you might have life and that you might have it more abundantly. Sickness is not good. It doesn't produce life. Losing your job is not good <clears throat> because you can't pay your bills, can't buy groceries, can't do the things that you need to do. That's not good. So it doesn't come from God. God didn't steal your job. The devil did and then blamed it on God so that you'd get mad at God and then not really appreciate the good things that he's doing. What you got to do is renew your mind to what the word says. Uh, Pat and I have been married 51 years, be 52. We're, our birthday's this, this coming week or two, and, and we've been here a pretty good while. But we are still just like we were when we were dating in high school. We're still just in love. We like to touch with each other. We like to hold hands. And we like to snuggle. We like to just um, sit around and look at each other and say, baby, I love you. And she says, yeah, and I love you. Hey, listen, it gets better with age, not worse with age. Listen. Don't let the devil tell you that you can't enjoy certain foods just because you got a little older. You know, you can't eat spicy foods anymore. Hey, I can eat spicy foods and enjoy it because my body's well. It's good. I enjoy it. And God gave me everything to enjoy. I've even had people say, better not drink coffee after 6 o'clock. Well, because you can't sleep. Well, I can drink coffee before 6 o'clock, after 6 o'clock, 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock. In fact, it's 2 o'clock this morning when I'm making this program. God's good, and i got to close this. So if it's bad, resist it. If it's good, receive it. It's real simple when you start looking at things. Okay, now is this good? Oh, yeah, it's good. I think I'll take that. Well, is this? Somebody said, well, I wouldn't want a million dollars because I, I might sin with it. Buddy, I'll take your million dollars and have a good time with it. Hey, i got to go. Where does time go when you're talking about the goodness of God and how bad the devil is? Saints, have a great day. And remember, all day long, Jesus is Lord, and thank God the Word works.